Hi everybody, hope your weekend's going well so far, and why would it not be? I mean, this weather is absolutely gorgeous. I'm meteorologist Matt Gray, let's get into the forecast for the rest of your weekend. So, Saturday, first 40 degree day in Spokane since the 13th of January. That is over three weeks, and that is the longest stretch that we have had so far this winter. And considering it is already February, that is probably going to be the longest stretch of this winter. Not necessarily that it's been super cold, but it, uh, well, certainly has been on the chillier side of things. And so this is our first kind of warm day we've had a little bit, and uh, uh, really nice to see some sunshine, finally out there. Temperatures uh, as we wake up on Sunday morning going to be in the middle and upper 20s. That's pretty typical for this time of the year. We're also going to be looking for some patchy fog and some low cloud cover, especially around the lower Columbia Basin in central Washington. Now around Spokane and Coeur d'Alene, any of that fog and low clouds will start to dissipate as we continue to warm up through the morning hours. And we'll be back in the 40s as we head into the afternoon with more sunshine so it's going to be another really really nice sunday so officially west plains area spokane 40 degrees 43 we're forecasting for Coeur d'Alene, 40 in bonners ferry and sandpoint and you can see places where we'll still see some clouds for a little bit longer we'll stay in the 30s such as omac we're going to be well into the 40s on the palouse and even getting into the 50s in the lc valley Four things you need to know about your forecast. All that severe sunshine is going to be sticking around. The boarding fog, the highs in the 40s. We're also going to be keeping an eye on a little system that's going to swing through our area on Monday. Not expecting a whole lot as high pressure is in control of our weather once again. And that means that it's going to be pretty quiet around here for a long time. You can already see its influence. All that wet weather in Montana on Saturday staying away from us because, once again, of that high pressure. So, what we're going to see, cloud cover, and then here comes this little system on Sunday night and Monday morning. And we might get a little flurry in the mountains, places like Lookout Pass and Fourth of July Pass could see some snowflakes. You may even get a little kind of rain, snow sprinkle, or a light little snow flurry in the morning around the Idaho Panhandle, Northeast Washington, even as far south as Spokane. But... This is not going to be anything to write home about. I'm giving our snow chances, rain snow chances, at, well, about 10%. So not very high. And the rest of the upcoming week is looking very, very dull. Should be some beautiful bluebird days up at our local ski area. So look at this. Lots of 40s on the board here. A little bit above our average. Our average high about this uh, time of year is about 37 degrees. We'll be a little bit breezy on Mondays. That weak little system comes through. And a little cloudier as well Monday into Tuesday morning. But we'll see the sun come out again late Tuesday. And we'll keep the sun around through the end of the week and into next weekend. So it looks like lots of beautiful wintertime weather is on the way to the inland northwest. That is awesome enjoy this weekend we will have another forecast update for you on sunday evening have a good one